hi guys welcome back to my channel hope you guys are doing well so here i am at kingston seawall georgetown guyana it's friday the 15th of september 2023 and i'm heading to witness the opening of the new transform kingston seawall it looks amazing and this project is the brainchild of our first lady aria ali and she's been working aggressively to enhance leisure spots especially Kingston Seawall, knowing, you know, everybody goes there to hang out and it's, it looks really great. And apart from that, she's also doing public places under her national beautification project. And this has been the third one. I, I believe it's the third one that's it's finished. Um, and she's opening it today. Uh, she's already done two of them. Uh, the one at La Jealousy on the west coast of Demerara. I did a video of that one. I will leave it at the end of this video so you can click in and check. Yeah. Also, she did one at the New Amsterdam Burbies. That one looks amazing as well. And this one here now she is currently opening. But then there's three others still on under development. And that one uh, is at diamond uh on the east bank as well diamond grove on the east bank of demerara then there's tushin on the east bank of essequibo and Coriviton in burbies so all those are being done but here i am they had uh the opening and then they had a few uh artists singing and so on so i'm going to show you all that i'm going to walk through the place and let you see what's happening um but before all of that, just let me tell you what was transformed. Why they, they say it's new transform. Well, she has added so many great things there. They're uh, fully refurbished bandstand. That's the first thing. Um, the bandstand right in front where, where those lights are. Not the colored, the other one, that's the bandstand. So it's fully refurbished. Then uh, our resurfaced tarmac. As you can see on the ground there, that's what she did. And then, well, I mean her project. Uh, then there's a newly built sanitary block and two promenades and a newly developed play park for children. That is so amazing. And then there's 18 vending units along a sprawling food court. And you can get from barbecue to pasta to ice cream. That is how great it is. So there's a new name for the Kingston Seawall now, and it's just an additional uh, word. So it's Kingston Seawall Esplanade, and Esplanade means a long, open, level area, typically beside the sea, along which people may walk for pleasure. So that's the name, Kingston Seawall Esplanade. So just to note, the tarmac has ramps, so those in wheelchairs can also enjoy the area and also there'll be free Wi-Fi. So I think this was a great time she decided to open the Kingston Seawall Esplanade because uh, we have a lot of tourists in Guyana. It's CPLT 20 and we're actually hosting the finals here. As you can see, there are two Guyana Amazon warriors already there taking out pictures with fans and it was a great time because there's, like I said, tourists in the country and they can come by and see how great the seawall looks and enjoy and relax and eat and just, just hang out with their friends and families. So it was a great initiative, a great timing and everything. So they had a few Guyanese artists performing there that day and Mystic is one of them. Um, you're going to see him in a few minutes. He's wearing white pants and colored shirt right there. That's uh, Mystic. And then there was Bicardi. He's Guyanese as well. And Tony Cutts. Uh, but Tony Cutts was actually born in Suriname and then he came over to Guyana. But um, they did a really good job there. They hyped up the place. It was like a mini concert, really nice.
So that's the police band actually playing there, entertaining the audience until the first lady arrives. So the first lady has arrived and we're all standing to welcome her but uh, once the first lady, the president or the prime minister arrives at an event, the national anthem plays and we all have to stand with our hands to our sides until it plays out and then everybody can sit. Nobody is, is supposed to be walking or moving around once that's being played. Honorable Ministers of Government, Members of the Diplomatic Forum, Members of the Public and Private Sector, all of our media operatives here this evening, our special invited guests, good evening to all of you, and welcome to the launch of the Escalade. I am your host, Kelly Robertson, and this evening, this beautiful Friday evening, is going to be full of entertainment and joy and celebration because we have transformed this area once again for everyone to enjoy, guides and visitors from all over the world. So this evening, I look forward to the wonderful speeches that will be done here. And let's start things off with a welcome and opening remarks from Mr. Raman Singh, the Director of Projects, Office of the First Lady. So we can ask together for Mr. Singh. Her Excellency, First Lady Ari Ali, Ministers of Government, members of the Four, members of the judiciary, members of the private sector, members of the public. Uh, a warm evening to you all. It allows this curiosity. And sometimes it's all here with enjoying this space. What else for us? And so I'm proud this evening to say that my boss. We realize that it is very important to ensure that people are to transform what we now know as the Constituency of Esplanade. And so, this story is a story about vision, it's a story about the two of us planning, and it's a story about diligent and precise execution. And so, it brings me immense joy and pleasure to the Constituency of Esplanade becomes one of your favorites in the country, not this joy show. So thank you so much and we'll enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you very much. 
very much, Mr. Z. And now we get ready for some remarks from the Minister with the Ministry of Public Works, the Honorable Mr. Diodat Indar. Please put your hands together for Mr. Indar. First Lady, colleagues and ministers, members of the diplomatic community, I see some of my friends from the private sector, special guests, ladies and gentlemen. There are some times when fights, when disagreements, when hard work, when put together, you get a good result. It's in the process of mining for gold. You have to go pick up the land, you have to go get the gravel, you have to go wash it out, you get the gold and you have to pass it through heat. Then you have to take it to a good little slip and then you see something of value, something that you can admire. I think that sums up what this project here um, went through. The vision of the First Lady and her partner in the Ministry of Public Works started a while ago. We built it piece by piece, piece by piece, as we do now. And tonight we are here to celebrate the result of whether we chose the wrong time, whether we didn't paint the colors in the shops in the right color or whatever, whatever we used to watch. It was a process of back and forth, compromise, but tonight we are celebrating the final product. But I cannot do justice here if I go back to the city. Because this is not the first project that we have worked on. We worked on the Jansi one. We worked on the, they worked on staff. The office of the force, the first second, they worked on staff to get these things um, together. My guys from Public Works, Saman, Mr. Kevin Saman. Saman has been with this project from the beginning. It's a public space and we need to do so maybe another day or so, maybe another few days or so, the person gets a chance to do the meeting, the thing, but it's going to the event at the end of the year, so that we can put it out and we can try to find a way in which the garbage can be managed properly in a better way. Because what we've been doing forever can't come here. We, we just can't keep the place done. Last week, before I leave the stage, Mr. Frank Sanichara, thank you, sir for coming on board, and all the other private sector persons that come on board and in, and they want Wi-Fi, and they want security cameras, and they want to get something like this. But in part, we also want to make sure that this project is why this today. Thank you. Beautiful. For generations to come, okay? But we're going to have some entertainment here tonight. Who's ready to have some fun? Are you ready? Let's get ready right now for Kevin Singh, this wonderful singer. Giving us his song, My Baby Diana. Good evening, Salam and Namaste. This is a story of the lady of my life, and I promise that I will never let go. I'm going away. I'm staying right here forever, Diana. This is my country. I'm going away, I'm staying right here forever, Guyana. One Guyana, let me go.
your Instagram and your Facebook pages. All right, everybody? Thank you so much to our dancers and that piece of dance, the National Dance Company, the Riverside Angel Dancers, and Burbeats Delight Dance Group. Put your hands together one more time for them. They were so delightful. Well, it's time now, everyone, for us to have some remarks by the Honorable Minister of Public Works, Mr. Juan Edgel. Please put your hands together and welcome him to the stage. And the evidence of that is seen in every region, in every village, and in every community. He was ably complimented by the vision and drive and passion of our First Lady. In a while we modernize and transform Diana, we must also beautify Diana and build spaces encourage wholesome family entertainment. And I think this is something we must congratulate the First Lady for her vision and her drive in this regard. Here at Kingston, see Wall Bandstand area, we embarked on a project where the specific outcomes were to ensure infrastructural, architectural, and landscaping enhancement. We wanted to ensure that we provide here in this space, based upon a contemporary spatial layout, the inclusion of amenities for the benefit of the general public. We wanted to improve recreational and tourism experience. And we also wanted to meet and, and ensure that social and cultural initiatives are enhanced. I would look forward, and I'm sure my first lady would look forward, when on many of our religious holidays and national holidays, we could have real life entertainment, good, wholesome family entertainment taking place right here on the Kingston Seawall. This project was executed by the Ministry of Public Works on the direction and initiative of the Office of the First Lady. I'm pleased to let you know that more than 30 small and medium-sized contracts and contractors were engaged in the work here, many of them very small, but they were given the opportunity to work. All the work that was done here was done by local contractors. What were some of the things that we did? We saw the rehabilitation of the seawall bandstand. This is a historical structure that was built since 1901 and we have successfully restored the seawall bandstand so to its original state. And I think we should be happy about that this afternoon. We have built 18 vending kiosks in the food court area that will provide a variety of Guyanese cuisine as well as international cuisine. We have a designated children play park with amenities and gazebos for family focus recreation. We have a promenade with decorative concrete pavers. We put in place seating amenities, decorative lighting, and disposable receptacles. We saw and we executed the rehabilitation of the concrete armor and we renewed and we renew the entire decorated section of the seawall uh, with paper. We have out here established and put in place facilities for a police outpost that will be manned 24 hours thanks to the Guyana Police Force Department. More importantly, we built a sanitary block which was financed and constructed by GBTI 
and that secondary block provides access for wheelchair and persons who are differently able. With support of ENET, we have put in place Wi-Fi, and this will be a free Wi-Fi zone. We have in place enhanced security, video surveillance cameras. We have put in street lighting, and we have moved away from the wooden poles that will have to be placed so often. And then we put in place concrete poles. We have established designated spaces for parking along the seawall road. We have done general landscaping Hello. and beach management. Hello. We have upgraded the seawall road with asphaltic concrete. And we have put in place a massive infrastructure of concrete drains and land rec reclamation works to facilitate the construction of the food code, which we are seeing behind us. Ladies and gentlemen, the Seawall Bandstand area is now a must-see place for every Guyanese and every tourist who come to Diana. Thanks to the initiative and drive of Madam First Lady. Let us give her a big hand of applause. We will continue to work, like my colleague Minister Indar indicated, not only here in Georgetown, but wherever we can make safe spaces, green spaces, family-oriented spaces under the direction of the initiative of our excellency. You would have noticed my Guyanese brothers and sisters you know, all of us gathered here that we have done work from all the way from the jetty at the back of the market, providing a new beach waterfront. And we are extending this all the way down the Ogle eventually, the Ogle Gap Station area eventually. The plan is there, the will is there, the leadership is there. In a matter of time, we will see much, much, much more. I'd like to ask all of us, guys, the beauty and the splendor and the magnificence of what we are seeing here. Let's do something to us to bring about a cultural change. The places where we recreate and we bring our families must be kept clean and tidy. We must be our brother's keeper. We must lend a helping hand when we see others as facing or littering. Let's quietly and nicely tell them, Diana is a nice place. Let's keep it nice. What we have done here, we want to keep it like this and we want to keep it going. The Ministry of Public Works will continue under the leadership of His Excellency to modernize and transform Hello. Diana in every way we can. And we will also continue with the initiative and vision of Her Excellency, the Madam Forest Lady, to beautify Diana and to work to make Diana a really nice place. God bless you all and thank you very much. Thank you so much, Minister, who's also here this evening as the acting Prime Minister. Thank you once again, everyone. Oh, how beautiful this space is. I love the fresh air out here, and that's why the entertainment is going to be even more beautiful. Because joining us right now is a singer that I have loved over the years. When I saw him, I said, boy, you look good. We've got Mystic <laughs> joining us tonight. And we will be singing that one Diana song. Please put your hands together for Miss Sid. Yeah, good night, how you doing? We gotta believe in this one Diana. We got to believe those words. 
Right? Y'all want to run it then? Just ahead 
and me, specially designed vending units. We have tried to ensure that it has a variety of local food and breakfasts you can choose from when you are out here. We have also made provision for small vendors and will be expanding this space to accommodate more. A big part of what I do is to ensure that all Guyanese have equal opportunities, even when it comes to spaces like these. So we have designed the washroom facilities and the tarmac with ramps, so those in wheelchairs can benefit from those facilities. This bandstand has also been refurbished, and I really want to implore all of you to take good care of it.
so guys hope you're entertained by this video don't forget to subscribe like and share and comment below comment let me know what you think of our new transform kingston seawall esplanade i know i'm gonna be down there on the weekends enjoying the atmosphere and enjoying what it has to offer the food the cool breeze coming in from the ocean and everything i know i'll be there and yeah barbecue is my favorite so i'm going to be checking out the barbecue places our local cuisines it's going to be there so come down it's it's a perfect spot now to just come and hang and chill with your friends and your family with that take care and i'll see you in the next one you guys can do better man Look, never gonna leave. Somebody say yeah, yeah. yeah. You guys having a good time right now?